Hey, what's up everyone? So today's pick a card reading is Why are you all that and more? I have three pals for you to choose from today. Pal one is the blue dice. Pal two is the red dice. And pal three is the yellow dice. Now, I will be sure to timestamp each pal and leave it below in the description box, all right? Feel free to choose more than one pal because more than one pal can be for you. Also, what you may not find in one pal, you may find in another pal. So always, always, always feel free to check out more than one pal. Also, before I get into it, I would like to thank you all for the likes, comments, and the subscribes. You are appreciated, all right? <laughs> so, now, let's get into it. All right, so for those of you who chose pal one, the blue dice. Before we get into it, let's see what numbers want to show themselves for you, pal one. We have six and six. So the number six could be significant to some of you, or you may see angel number six, six, six a lot. Also, you may see threes a lot. Angel number 333 three, three a lot or significant to you. Um, or the number nine may be significant to some of you. And I'm also getting the number 12 could be significant to some of you, all right? So now let's get into it. Let's see why are you all that and more. Pal one, all right? First card is the eight of wands. The Seven of Pentacles, The Fool, Nine of Cups, Queen of Swords. We also have the Greens. All right. And it says the classic. We have the Knight of Fire. Individuality. And last but not least. Is co-create. One, let me start off by saying, I feel like everything about you is organic, okay? This is what I'm getting with the greens card, okay? These look like these may be collard greens, okay? <laughs> and then also with the classic. So I'm getting, I just feel like you're very original or you don't mind being yourself. And um, that's just confirmation with the individuality card. I feel like power when you're someone who has individuality, you don't mind being who you are. You stay true to yourself. Um, but I feel like you're definitely someone who is very organic, you know, is what I'm getting with the greens in the classic card. Because when I see classic, I just get original, okay? Um, I also feel like you're a natural beauty, okay? Because with organic, I'm getting natural. So I also feel like you're a natural beauty. Um, I also feel like you're someone who accepts yourself for who you are. Positive or negative. You embrace every part of yourself, not just the positive things. 
I feel like you're someone who can admit when you're wrong and you can recognize weaknesses, but still fully accept yourself. See, self-acceptance is unconditional and not everyone can do that. Pal one, I just got to say that you are very rare is why you are all that. You are one of a kind. No, no other person is exactly like you. And I feel like you know this and you embrace this now. It's why you are all that. I feel like some of you may not have always been this way. That's why I said you embrace this now, because I definitely feel like some of you may not have always been this way. But you started marching to the beat of your own drum. Others of you, I feel like you've always have marched to the beat of your own drum. And it's very attractive, might I add, okay? <laughs> Yeah. And with the Night of Fire, I definitely feel like, you know, you're just very self-accepting. You accept everything about yourself, and I feel like that's very attractive. Um, I feel like the fact that, you know, with the Night of Fire, confident, passionate, adventurous, you're confident within who you are. And you have to be, to be able to have, you know, your own individuality, okay? And to be able to accept yourself as well in every single way, you know? So, um, pal one, I'm about to pull a few cards, okay? From my deck. It's like two decks in one of mine, okay? But just to see, um, you know, why else are you all that, baby? <laughs> why are you all that and more? We have good looking. So you're very physically attractive. Power one. Is why you're all that and more. But I, like I said, I feel like you're naturally just, you know, physically attractive. At that, you know. I feel like some of you, you know, you don't, um, you may not wear makeup or if you wear makeup, it's very like, um, it's not much. Maybe it's neutral colors or something, but, um, wear your natural hair. I also feel like some of you may have tattoos, okay? But why are you all that power one? You're naturally good looking, okay? <laughs> you don't have to, do, have to do too much, okay? You don't have to stand in the mirror all day, okay? You naturally just got it like that. <laughs> and you got some admirers, okay? You have some admirers that find you to be all that, okay, baby? Drooling over you, period. <laughs> Let's see what this is. Ooh, some of you have a big old booty. Okay, with the big old booty car showing itself, all right. Okay, this may be another reason why you are all that. You have a big old booty, all right, or a nice booty. <laughs> they don't have to be all that big. Oh, that's too many. <laughs> I would have took you, but there's too many. Oh, what's this? 
Oh, some of you, look, we got mysterious. So it may be something a bit mysterious about you, but it's, you know, I feel like it may make you all that just because it, I feel like it's intriguing. People may find you to be intriguing. Some type of mystery there about you. People don't know everything. I feel like you may be the type of person you don't put all your business out there in one setting, okay? You leave people wanting to know more, okay? And that may be in the way you dress or style yourself as well, pal one. And it says you're everybody's type, okay? So this may be why you are all that. A lot of people may find themselves attracted to you. You may have a lot of options, okay? Or a lot of people that crush on you. And we got the 10, 10 perfect. So, it's some people that find you to be the whole package, baby. That may find you to be a 10. But I feel like what makes you a 10 is that you just organically, naturally got it like that. You ain't got to do a lot. You ain't got to do too much, baby. You naturally just got it like that, period. <laughs> wise one. So, we got the wise one card that flipped over. So you may also be someone who's very wise, okay, or very wise for your age. I just feel like it's really attractive, the uh, your individuality, you know, the fact that you're self-assured, okay. You don't need validation from others. You have self-validation. I feel like that is very attractive and we got tattoos confirmation some of you definitely have tattoos or a tattoo in particular and it's funny that this came on out because i seen this earlier with all like it was probably like four cards that came out but i stuck them back in the deck and this was on top and it came out again this is my good vibes card why are you all that i feel like people love your vibes or they can't get enough of your vibes okay you have you're someone with who has good vibes Definitely feel like um also that you're someone who's very truthful, you know. I feel like you keep it honest with yourself first and foremost. And so, you know, of course it's easier, it's easy for you to keep it honest with others as well. Mm hmm With the Queen of Swords. 420. Okay. 420 could be significant to some of you. Also, some of you could um smoke weed, a little bit of that Mary J. I love you, Mary Jane. Okay, don't give me <laughs> Mary Jane. <laughs> don't get me started. Child, what? Yeah, some of y'all, hey, if, the, if 428 significant to some of you, some of you definitely smoke that Mary Jane. <laughs> and we got social distancing, social clubs. So some of you are anti social. Okay, I don't want to say antisocial. People may feel like some of you are antisocial. Maybe some of you are antisocial, but this is really my introvert card. So, is why social distancing is easy for some of you. Some of you may be an introvert, period. Mm -hmm. You like your space, you like your time. You may not let people in easily as well as what I'm getting with that, okay? is why you may come off a bit mysterious, okay? And not just in, in intriguing. I feel like it's intriguing to others, others because you leave people wanting more, you know, or want to know more. Yeah, look, crush. Ooh, ooh, uh, ooh. Yeah, uh, ooh. <laughs> look, you're everybody's type. I feel like this confirmation to the you're everybody's type card. I feel like people may fall for you easily or crush on you easily or something like that. Or you have a crush in particular, baby. Period. All right. Oh, what that? Yeah, it's because you're different from most. But what makes you different from most, pal, one, is your individuality. Your individuality, baby. Not everybody can accept all of them. Not everybody can accept themselves okay 100 percent you know what i'm saying well not everybody can take the good and the bad about themselves and accept that shit man like you power one all right that's a trap though okay that's what makes you all that 
I feel like it's attractive. You know, it's just very attractive. Um, it just let you know. I feel like that lets me know that you're someone who's uh, very comfortable in your skin or confident. Um, and like I said, I I feel like some of you it took some work. I definitely feel like some of you it wasn't always like this or it wasn't easy, but you know you learn and you you have really grown to accept yourself. You really have grown, I feel like, self-love for yourself. And I'll take these last three cards before I end your reading. Power one. Yeah, authentic. You're someone who's very authentic with the individual individuality card coming out. Yeah. This is why you're all that, okay? It's your authenticity. It's very attractive. More people need to get like you, baby. Okay, and it's the online card came out. You may have a strong presence online. Some of you may do something online on social media. And you may have a strong presence online. I feel like people notice, notice you or you're definitely someone who stands out. I feel like you stand out amongst the crowd um, because you're definitely someone who has individuality. Um, I also feel like you're someone who's very unique, okay? Um you also may have a crush online or people who admire you or crush on you online that watch you or pay attention to you or watch every time you post or something or make a status, okay? For those of you who have um, some type of online account or social media platform. Um, and this card says strong presence. Your energy in introduces you before you even speak. Big energy status, all right? Yeah, I feel like you definitely have um, big energy. And, um, you know, people, you're someone who is definitely noticed, I feel like, and stand out amongst the crowd. You're someone who is noticed, I feel like, wherever you go. It's your uniqueness. It's your individuality. It's what makes you you. And um, it's what makes you, you know, you stand out. That's why you're all that, Okay. Your energy. You don't have to say, you don't have to say a mumbling word. <laughs> you don't have to say a thing, baby. You ain't got to say a thing. Okay, baby, what? <laughs> Child, I'll be doing the most sometimes, honey, period. Period. Y'all excuse that. <laughs> but yeah. But it's your original originality, baby. <laughs> Power one. And it's what makes you all that. I mean, honestly, you got to love someone who is just bold and confident enough. With the night of fire, confident, passionate, adventurous. Probably someone, some of you may like to uh, try new things or, you know, or do new things or different things. But um, you got to respect someone who is accepting of themselves you know who is bold and brave enough to be th themselves and accept all of them you know yourself wholeheartedly because you know i feel like you know there are some people that may admire you power one because like i said everybody can't do that so you have some people i feel like that look look up to you and they admire that about you that you don't, I feel like you don't try to change yourself. You don't try to change yourself to fit in a in anybody's box or fit the mold or whatever. You just, you just do you. I'm going to do me. I'm going to do me. <laughs> why am I, I don't know why I just got that, y'all, but I feel like that's you, you know. You just do you. And I also feel like you somebody, you mind your business, pal. When you just do you, you ain't worried about, hey, you like, you do you, I'm going to do me. And you worry about what you got going on, period. <laughs> you someone who stay in your lane, and that's what makes you all that, baby. Some of you are a bit laid back, and, and people still drawn to you or whatever. You know, you're just confident within you who you are. You don't need a gang of people around you, and, and that's what makes you all that. Ooh, we now, baby. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Whoop, whoop, whoop. 
okay. <laughs> okay, so with the Knight of Fire, some you definitely may be a fire sign or you have a fire sign placed me in your chart. Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. We also have Aquarius that came out. So some of you may be an Aquarius or you have an Aquarius placement in your chart. We also have Taurus. Some of you may be a Taurus or you have a Taurus placement in your chart. Uh, some of you also may be a Gemini or a Libra, or you have a Gemini or Libra placement in your chart. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Some of you may be a water sign, or you have a water sign placement in your chart, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio, all right? But that completes this reading. That completes your message, pal. One. If it resonated with you, baby, give it a like, comment, or subscribe. If you did not, feel free to check out any other of the pals, baby. All right. I thank you so, so much. Until next time. All right, so for those of you who chose Pal 2, the red dice, we're about to get into it and we're about to see why are you all that and more. But before we get into it, let's see what numbers want to show themselves for you, all right? And we have five and we have three. The number five could be significant to some of you. The number three could be significant to some of you. Um, also the number eight could be significant to some of you, all right? Now let's get into it. First card is the seven of cups, the king of wands, Ooh. the eight of pentacles, the high priestess, it says the flame. And that's like a bottle of to pass. Baby, to pass. What is to pass? Okay. I meant to say that's a bottle of like Tabasco sauce or hot sauce. Okay. It's put me in the mind of Tabasco sauce or hot sauce. All right. I don't know what the, what the, what is to pass? <laughs> to pass you by. Period. <laughs> okay. Y'all, I'm in a playful mood today. Okay. Excuse me. We also have the thickest, okay? And that's a milkshake or whatnot, okay? Cherry flavor milkshake with a little whipped cream on top. We also have the page of air. High Priestess of Fire. Ooh, so some of you definitely are fiery, baby. Because we got the flame and we got the High Priestess of Fire. Some of y'all definitely fiery, okay? Some of y'all may be a bit sassy, period. And we got Thinker. Ooh, yeah. All right? Last but not least is the Thinker card. So, Pal 2. Let's see. Let's get into it, baby. Um... I feel like you're highly intelligent, okay? Let me start off by saying that, okay? Mm -hmm. With the high priestess, even with the king of wands, in the page of air. Child, we got the... Child, we got the high priestess of fire, too, okay? So we have two high priestess laid out. We got the high priestess, the high priestess of fire. All right, okay. <laughs> So that's just like double confirmation. Um, a lot of y'all are very intuitive. I will say that, okay? Um, but like I was saying, I feel like you're highly intelligent, okay? With a side of sexy, okay? You're highly intelligent with a side of sexy is why you are all that and more. I feel like you are very clever and you have a strong sense of self. You're someone who has the ability to think, okay, with the thinker card. Understand and learn things quickly, okay? Yeah. So I feel like you're very quick-witted, observant, and you have a good memory. I feel like you're a good planner as well because you're someone who's always thinking 10 steps ahead. Ooh, all right? Yeah. I also feel like you're practical yet 
creative with the king of wands and analytical with the page of air as well okay because the page of air card says truthful analytical and outspoken okay I feel like you're someone who loves to learn and you always want to know more. And I see that you may also be someone who values your solitude, okay? You value your alone time, okay? Some of you may be an introvert, okay? That's what I feel like. All right. And with the thickest card. Okay, why are you all that? Some of y'all got a banging body is what I feel like with the high priestess. And the thickest, some of you, some of y'all, baby, y'all got a banging body. Ooh. Ooh, -wee. ooh, la la. Baby, I was supposed to say shoe la la. Ooh, so shoe la la. Some of y'all may really love shoes because I ain't gonna lie, I like the high priestess. I like her shoes, all right, period. And then I was gonna say shoe la la. So some of y'all probably have nice taste in shoes as well. Mm hmm. I'm just going with it, baby. I'm just going with the flow because I was going to say shoe la la. So, okay. So, some of you may have good taste in shoes or sneakers, you know, or whatnot, or heels, sandals. It don't matter, baby. Any type of shoe. You just may have nice collection of shoes or good taste in shoes as well, okay? Your shoes are all that, all right? <laughs> but, yeah, some of y'all have a nice shape or a nice figure as well, a nice body or something, I feel like. That is all that. So let me pull some cards. We're about to see why are you all that and more. Ciao. Wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ciao. Okay. Let me show y'all what I got here. We got the unique. So a lot of you may be very unique. And I feel like there's a uh, confirmation to the fact that I feel like a lot of you are very creative, okay? Most creative people are unique. You may have a unique way of doing things, you know? Most creative people have uh, creative people have a unique way of doing things, a different way of doing things with the different from most. So the way you do things or however you may uh, make your money, your job, or whatever it is you do for work as well with the Eight of Pentacles is probably different from most or very creative. Um, even if there's others that do what you do, yours um, may stand out as very creative. What you do is very different, okay, is why you are all that. Yeah, okay, for sure. This is confirmation. It says, success is doing ordinary things extraordinary well. I feel like, pal, too. Wait a minute, baby. I feel like everything you touch, baby, everything you do, you do it extraordinary well, okay? I feel like you're someone who has the mightiest touch. I feel like everything you touch turns into gold, baby. I'm turned up today, period, okay? Just um, bear with me. <laughs> um, and then, look, we got my star card that came out. So why are you all that? Pal, too, I feel like you have a star-like quality, okay, about you. And it could be your look as well, okay? Yeah, okay, so we have the individuality card. You be you, I'll be me. So you're someone who um, definitely has individuality. Big old booty card came out. So I feel like there's confirmation to the thickest. Some of you have a thick behind, period, okay? That. Ass is all that, so, right? So, all that's in a bag of chips with a little bit of hot sauce on it, period. Online. Mm. So, I feel like it's possibly people who check you out online. Maybe some of you, you work online or you do something from online. And it's very different from most the way you do it because I split the deck. Look, baby, you're creative. Uh, confirmation, you're creative as fuck. Ooh. Channel on. Y'all, <laughs> I'm very playful today, all right? <laughs> Whoa, what's that? What's that right there? Ooh, you're charming. Okay, this is why y'all that. You're very charming. Yeah, I definitely feel like you're someone who has charisma. Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, you may also be someone who's honest. I feel like there's confirmation to the page of air, right? The page of air is the page of swords, the sword of truth. So I feel like you may be someone who's honest as well, you know? It may be trustworthy. Oh, child, that is too much. But look what I see. Look what I see here. Hold on one a minute. The man with the plan. Confirmation to the thinker card that came out. I feel like you're a good problem solver. Mm -hmm. You're always thinking 10 steps ahead. You always got a plan. You always got a solution to a problem. I feel like people can come to you as well. And no. Mm. Should I take these? Well, I'll take these first three anyways. Okay. So. I'll take all four because they may just be for you. So we have social media. So there's people who may watch you on social media who feel like you are all that, okay? For those of you who have a social media account. And we also have, I shall not be shaken. Let your faith be bigger than your fear. Feel like you're someone who is strong within yourself and confident. And that is why you are all that as well. And look, ooh, confirmation with the flame. You're, you're hot, baby. You keep it sexy. I feel like you're someone who has beauty with brains, okay? And it says life is all about balance. So you may also be someone who has balance in your life, okay? Or you may have your feminine, your masculine energy is very well balanced, possibly. And we have confident confirmation. You're just confident and thick like a snicker. Thick. Thick, 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 like a snicker. Thick, 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 like a snicker. Confirmation to the thickest card. Some of y'all thick as fuck. All right? Some of y'all just thick, okay? And if you don't feel like you're all that thick, you probably just thick in all the right places or you have a little, something that's nice and thick on you. Or you're maybe curvy, okay? Because I'm also getting curvy. You have nice curves, period. Mm-hmm. But my man, maybe with the thick card, when it come out, you could be someone who is buff or you work out or whatnot. Ooh, child, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, rest in peace, haters. You're killing the haters. This is why you are all that, pal, too. You're killing your haters, okay? Rest in peace, haters. Really? Can we have a moment of silence for like two, three seconds, period? All right, rest in peace, haters, period. Okay, then. So this is why you are all that. You're killing your haters uh, softly, kindly. You just, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me bring that car back. Ooh. Where is it? I feel like you just doing, you just do you. Okay, you just being you. <laughs> it says, you be you, I'll be me. You just being you is killing your haters, okay? Somebody, go revive them, baby. Baby, go. Somebody, go give them CPR or something. Give them CPR. CPR. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh, look. Confirmation, confident. Wait a minute. How many times? See, I didn't say it, confident. Child, y'all got to see. Oh my goodness, I feel like your haters can't stand your damn confidence, baby. They can't bring you down for shit. This is why you all that, baby. <laughs> Cause listen, we got two confidence cards that came out. So damn it, your haters mad. They can't even bring you down, baby. They can't even knock you off your goddamn pedestal, whatever the fuck. Your high horse. Oops, excuse my language, but I'm just saying. Cause I feel like some of y'all. With the rest in peace haters card coming out like that, you really have people that you be having people that hate on you for no damn reason. I feel like you be like, damn, what did I do? What the fuck? What did I do? What did I do to you? Why are you mad? Why are you big mad? What's going on? I didn't do anything. Wait a minute, do I even know you? Period. Especially if some of y'all do something online, baby. Oh, gosh, there's other people in the same field as you. Why well, I feel like with the high priestess, some of y'all could be tarot readers. You got some haters, okay? And you're killing your haters. See, they over there in secret competition with you, okay? And you ain't even got it. Like I said, if you may not, some of y'all, 
A lot of y'all may not even be a tarot reader, but some of you may be with the high priestess, all right? Very intuitive. But it's something some of y'all do online, okay? With the social media card and the online card came out. Some of y'all do something online or social media and you got some haters. You don't even know some of these people. They don't even know you like that. But yeah, they're hating on your creativity and your gifts, okay? And your money, baby. Your pentacles, all right? Um, and you just say, like, damn, what did I do? But baby, it's just you being you, baby. Okay, it's just being you being you. It's got your, yeah, your big energy, okay? It's got the haters bothers, okay? Yes, you got some secret haters, secret enemies that you don't even know about. Okay, some of you probably, some of them, I'm sure you do. But some of these people, I feel like, pal, too, you don't even know. For some of you, you may not work online, but, you, baby, you just be posting your pictures and your statuses. And you got some people that just hate the own, baby, just hate they see your picture or video, okay, baby, or, or status or meme or whatever it is that you post. And, baby, they hate it. And some, of you, you, some of you, I feel like your style could be creative. How you style your hair or your makeup or your clothes or just whatever. Look, inventive. This is my Albert Einstein card, the inventive card, a.k.a. my creative card, okay? Yeah, confirmation. I feel like that's double confirmation. You're very creative and your haters can't stand it. Your haters can't stand how good looking you are. Baby, let me get off these haters. But this is why you are all that. But dang, I'm picking up on your haters' energy and they cannot stand your creativity. They can't stand your big energy. Okay? They can't stand how good looking you are. Yeah. Sometimes you just got to roll with it and baby, your haters want to come through and just let you know how they really feel about you. Period. <laughs> Oh, goodness, that's sad because I feel like y'all don't even know. You're like, I don't even know you. Some of these people, I feel like, uh, if you, for those of you, if you do something online or you post often online, you don't even know these people. These people don't even know you like that, but they jelly or they just, you know, they're hating. They feel some type of way about your presence. Your social media presence is what I'm getting. But anywho. Let's get back to your creativity is why you're all that, all that. You're good looking, you're smart, you're intelligent, baby. You just all that in a bag of chips, baby, with a little soda on the side, baby. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're sexy as hell, you know, is what I'm getting. What, look, you the best. For some of y'all, it is something you do online. You the best at what you do, baby. You bring the straight, you bring something different to the table. You bring a whole new flavor, baby. You bring something spicy and, and your haters. It's mad, and this is why y'all that, because you the best, okay? And you also, listen, pal, too, you're becoming your best version of yourself. The best version of yourself, you're becoming your greatest version, and this is why you are all that, period. Let me pull one or two more cards before I end your reading, pal, too. Okay, you are very interesting, pal, too. This is funny, okay, because your haters want to come through and let you know how they feel. If you didn't already know, then now you know. All right, that's the last card I'm taking. Okay, and it says social distancing, social club. So, some of you definitely may enjoy your solitude, your alone time. Some of you may be ambiverts, okay? I feel like some of you are introverts, but you know how to be an extrovert when necessary, when needed. You know when to be an extrovert, but I feel like majority of the time you're more of an introvert. I also feel like this is also letting me know because this is my introvert card. But I'm getting that some of y'all are introverts, but I'm also getting that some of y'all are ambiverts. Ambiverts are introverts and extroverts. It just means that if you're an ambivert, you're an introvert, but you know how to be an extrovert when necessary. And that's what I feel like some of you are ambiverts and other others of you are introverts, all right? And I'm also getting with the social distance, social club. You just have a very strong presence. Somebody, listen, if it's just one somebody that chose Pal 2, you have a strong social uh, presence, okay? Social media presence. And um, this is why you are all that, baby. You got some people that is uh, a little salty, okay? Feel some type of way. Because that's just funny that my rest in peace haters came out. So I feel like it's with the rest in peace haters, you're killing the haters because you have some people or someone in particular that is in secret competition with you, okay? And this is for somebody. And, for, and, and with the high priestess, some of y'all, high priestess and the high priestess of fire, a lot of you are very intuitive. So you already intuitively know who somebody is, you know, who this person is in particular, or you just intuitively know that it's some people you have haters. 
And you didn't do nothing, baby. You was just doing you, baby. You was just being you, period, you know? So, some of you may be an air sign with the page of air, and we also have Libra. So, some of you may be an air sign or have an air sign placement in your chart. Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. Some of you, uh, oh, look, we have Aquarius. So, a lot of you are very, a lot of you are air signs. Mm-hmm. It makes sense, all right, period. A lot of you are air signs. But I'm also getting... Or if you're not an air sign, you have an air sign placement. I'm also getting that some of you are fire signs with the flame because I'm just getting sexy, hot, spicy. So some of you definitely may be a fire sign or have a fire sign placement in your chart. Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Um, also, some of you may be a water sign, um, a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. And I also feel like some of you may be a Capricorn or you have a Capricorn placement in your chart. If you're not a water sign, you may have a water sign placement in your chart. But that completes your reading. That completes this message. Pile 2, if it resonated with you, give it a like, comment, or subscribe. All right? If it did not, feel free to check out any of the other pals. Also, feel free to go on my channel and check out my Pick a Card Messages playlist. All right? <laughs> Thank you so much. Until next time, Pile 2. All right, so for those of you who chose pile three, the yellow dice. We're about to get into it, and we're about to see why are you all that and more, okay? But before we get into it, let's see what numbers want to show themselves on your dice that you chose, okay? Ew, ooh-wee, baby. So we have two and three. The number two could be significant to some of you. The number three could be significant to some of you. And the number five could be significant to some of you, all right? Now, let's get into these cards, okay? First card is the sun. Ooh, okay. King of Cups. Nine of Pentacles. Six of Wands. Three of Cups. It says forever golden, okay? Living your life like it's golden, golden. Are y'all living your life like it's golden, baby? And we have Ace of Drinks, okay? Well, I feel like some of y'all living your life like you're golden, like it's golden. You're living your best life right now. You just, you live good. I feel like you celebrate every day like every day is a holiday. Ooh, baby, I'm already, I ain't even got all the cars out, but I just feel like, pal, wait a minute, pal, three, yeah, living life like it's golden, celebrating. You know, every day is a celebration. Mm -hmm. When you're just thankful and positive and happy, that's just let me know a lot of you are very positive, okay? Um, every day is like a celebration, you know? So we have the two of earth. It says meditation. And it says happy, happy. Well, pal three, okay? Let me start off by saying, why are you all that, baby? I feel like your energy is out of this world, okay? I feel like you're someone who's very charming. Yeah. With the sun and the king of cups, okay? I feel like you're someone who's very charming, and pleasant to be around you know you're also very energetic positive and uplifting and i also see that you have a great personality and a good sense of humor i feel like people fall for you easily and are easily drawn to you okay with you being the sun or having this sun energy okay shout out to my leos period <laughs> I feel like people can't resist your charm, okay? And your magnetic personality is why you are all that, baby. You don't have to do too much. People are just naturally drawn to you. 
And this is why you are all that, okay? Okay, another reason why you are all that. Um, I feel like you are someone who lights up a room when, when you enter. I also feel like you have the ability to change the atmosphere in a room. I feel like you have amazing energy, pal three, and it can't be copied. Might I add, is why you are all that. I also feel like there's something pure, okay, with the Ace of Drinks. I feel like there's something pure about your energy and very refreshing. And I also feel like with the Forever Golden, okay, it's 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 fries, baby, it's fries. Some of you may uh really love fries, okay, or potatoes or whatnot. But with the Forever Golden, I feel like um you are someone who is forever young, okay. With the Forever Golden card showing itself, I definitely feel like you're someone who is very, um, who is forever young. Okay, because with the two of earth, it says balance, playfulness. It says balance, prior, child, I'm about to tear that word up, baby, prior, prior, prioritization. Okay, so you know how to prioritize. You're someone who prioritizes, okay. And then it says playfulness, baby. I am not for... <laughs> But sometimes I get tongue tied and twisted, baby. I'm, I'm not prioritizing. But you know what I'm talking about. You're someone who knows how to prior, pri, prioritize. Period. Yeah. Okay then. Hey. Okay. So it says balance, prioritize, and playfulness. So you know, with that in the forever golden, I feel like that's. I mean, you know, that lets me know that power three. I feel like you're someone who is forever young, you know? You're someone who know, knows how to make time for playtime. You may be someone who don't take life too serious, you know? You know how to balance it out with a little playtime, with a little, you know how to let your hair down some, you know how to have a good time, you know how to celebrate when you need to, take some time out and to just let your hair down, baby, and celebrate. And I also feel like people just, this is how people feel around you, like, I also feel like you make people feel celebrated. Something about your energy. And then you make people, look, it says happy, happy. But I feel like you're someone, just let me know, you're someone who's very positive. But people feel happy and very energetic when they're around you, okay? But yeah, this is why you're all that. Because a lot of you are aging like fine wine, baby, okay? Period. With me getting the fact that uh, you're forever young, I feel like your energy you know, it's all about the energy, baby. It's all about the energy. And I feel like, you know, you're someone who is just, you have a very youthful spirit, youthful and vibrant spirit about you. And I feel like you're a good time. You know, people enjoy themselves around you. People feel good. I also feel like people feel youthful around you. Okay. So some of you are, you know, really young. Okay. Okay. But others of you, I feel like you just look very young for your age and your in your energy, very energetic for your age as well, your spirit. And you know, it's all about the inside, you know. How you are on the inside, it starts showing on your on your outward, your outer appearance. But I feel like, you know, just just as why are you all that pal three? I feel like you have a beautiful soul, beautiful energy, and it shows, okay? It shows in your, your outer appearance is why you are aging gracefully, I feel like. Yeah, you let me tell y'all what this first card. I didn't realize the first card that came out, this is the second card, and I'm finna get to it. But the first card that came out says, Life is better when you're laughing, live every moment, laugh every day. Love beyond words. See, this is why you're aging like fine wine. I feel like a lot of you are actually aging backwards. Because you're someone who doesn't stress or worry often or easily. You, you're someone who lives in the moment. You're someone who laughs every day. And you love beyond words. Not just the people that are in your life or that's close to you, but yourself. You're someone who has self-love, okay? And it says X marks the spot. 
why are you all that because just clearly with the x marks the spot card coming out you still have some x's that's stuck on you or a x in particular that is still stuck on you realizing that you was the best thing since sliced bread baby realizing that you was a blessing in their life realizing that you was their light at a dark time period okay and then you just they let you slip through like that and what you've been having this sun type of energy i definitely feel like some y'all have drawn in energy vampires in the past okay people that didn't know your worth or didn't accept you or want to dim your light or drain you of your big beautiful energy all right but you're someone who your light could never be put out. Ooh, period. Oh, my God. Oof. Y'all, that's attractive, okay? It's all about the energy, and it's the energy for me, baby. It's your energy, okay? That's what I'm feeling over here at Pile 3. That's why your energy could never be duplicated. I'm trying to see if I can reach it with my foot without getting up. Ooh, there you go. Okay, I'll get there in a second. <laughs> oh, what's, what's that? Keep it simple. Wow. People, uh, some people may want to know, and you may have been asked this, what's your secret? Why you look so good? Why your skin looks so good for your age? And why you tend to seem like the better? Look, I feel like a lot of you, Power 3, the older you get, the better you, you look, baby. You like fine wine. You, know? you get better as you age or as you get older. You don't age, actually, okay, period. You know, the, the number go up, okay, the age of the number go up. But, baby, you look like you're just stuck in time somewhere. <laughs> Okay, but I feel like you keep it simple. I feel like a lot of you keep a simple life, you know. You don't let things stress you easily. You don't do things if it's going to stress you or if it's going to compromise, you know, your, your self-worth or your integrity or whatnot, okay, or your values. And I feel like you're someone who keeps it simple, you know. This is why, y'all, that you ain't got to do too much. Just let me know that, you know, pal three, you ain't got to do too much, baby. You ain't got to do too much. You keep it simple. And yet you're popping the way you popping. You popping, baby. Popping. Okay, okay. Child. <laughs> yeah, my energy is, um, you know, it's, it's, it's really up there today, okay? <laughs> I couldn't calm it down, okay, before I start recording today. You know, you're just gonna have to get all of all of this big energy that's going on today, baby. <laughs> so we have the 420 card that came out. So 420 could be significant to some of you, or some of you may be um you may smoke weed or you know, marijuana, you know, you may like Mary Jane for some of you, okay? Yeah, period social media okay so you have some people maybe on social media that find you to be all that baby all that and more i feel like you have a nice or a really positive or bright social media presence okay oh wow listen pal three you're beautiful inside and out okay this is why y'all that you're irresistible some people feel like they gotta have you period you know people want you oh oh my goodness who's who y'all got mad? Pal three. Who that you got mad? We got the bit mad card came out. Who is bit mad? Listen, pal three. Some of you, I feel like people, baby, you be having people bit mad. You just enter a room, okay? Some people can't stand your presence. Some people can't stand your lights, okay? Your light disturbs some people demons, okay? Some people can't stand you to walk in because, look, you keep it simple. You ain't got to do too much, baby. You ain't got to do too much. Listen, you ain't got to do too much. You ain't got to do all that to get attention. I don't even feel like some of y'all care to get attention. You just do, okay? It's your energy, okay? You're felt. Your energy is felt, period. And there's some people big mad. They're like, dang. I feel like some people hate when you step on the scene. This just is what it is, baby. It is what it is. Look. Some of y'all, look, why are you all that? You're a boss. So some of you are an entrepreneur or you're branching out to be an entrepreneur. You're doing something on your own or you have a boss like mindset or boss mentality or you have a boss or a leader uh, position on the job. Okay. 
is why you are all that, okay? And it says success is doing ordinary things extraordinarily well, okay? So I feel like you're someone, you know, you do everything you do. Uh, ugh, everything you touch turns into gold, possibly. You know, everything you do, you do it. You don't just do it good, baby. You don't just do it well. You do it extraordinary well, okay? And that's probably why some people hate on you. Yeah, okay, this is the, what it is. You're very creative. Everything you do, you do it in such a creative way. You put your own little touch, your own little spin on it, baby. Some of y'all got some sexy lips. That's why y'all that, you know, people may find your lips to be a trap. And yeah, it says you the best, baby. This is why y'all that, okay? Now, let me see. Because I think we, yeah, we had the S card. So this is why you're all that. You have some essence that realize that you are all that and more and that you was the best thing to happen to him, baby. But it's too late, okay? I'm getting it's too late to apologize. It's too late. Okay, period. But listen, you the best, okay? You what you the best. I feel like you're becoming you're the becoming your greatest version, okay? You're becoming the best version of yourself, okay? Is why you're all that. And look, online confirmation. We have social media and online, so you got people that be checking you out online. They feel like you're all that, okay? You still have excess that for some of you are watching you online, okay? Watching you move on, watching you be great, watching you still shine. For some of you, you have an ex in particular that thought you weren't gonna shine or thought you weren't gonna be shat without them, okay? And they're watching you, okay? Look, honest. You may be someone who is honest, okay? With the honest card coming out like that. Ew. Why are you all that? You got swag, baby. It's your swag. Your swag is all that. With the fresh card, I feel like some of y'all can dress. Some of y'all really be styling and profiling, baby. You dress yourself very well. You know what I'm saying? Especially when I see the king of cups. Yeah, fresh. Some of y'all have a very... You got swag, baby. Your style is all that, baby. Your swag, your style is all that. Let me see if I can reach this card, y'all. Cause you know, let's see him. Ooh, you got a crush. Now, when I see this card, I feel like you have a crush in particular, or this is also let me know that people crush on you easily. This is confirmation to the fact that people fall for you easily. Pal three, okay. People crush on you easily. And on the bottom of the deck, it says nice ass. So some of you, especially for my women, you have a nice ass or a nice size ass, okay? And this is why you are all that as well, okay? You got a nice little figure or a nice ass or a nice shape of the ass, okay? <laughs> Something about that ass. And the last two cards is we got 10, 10 perfect. Why are you all that? I feel like you're like the whole package. Definitely feel like a lot of you are beautiful inside and out, okay? Not only are you energetically attractive, you have a beautiful soul, but I feel like you're physically attractive as well. So with the 1010 Perfect card, this is why you're all that. Because, hey, you're the whole package. And last but not least, it says naturally dope, okay? You just naturally got it like that. You just naturally, you ain't got to do too much, baby. You know what I'm saying? You just naturally got this swag, you know, energetically that um attracts people that pulls people in and you may also be someone who is natural i feel like some of y'all are natural beauties you don't have to do too much in the look department as well we have pisces so some of you definitely may be a pisces with the king of cups and we have the ace of drinks water some of y'all definitely are a water sign or you have a water sign placement pisces cancer or scorpio some of you also may be a leo or you have a leo placement in your chart let's see what else want to come out before i end your reading power three water double confirmation pisces and water so some of you definitely are water signs or you have a water sign placement in your chart and let me pull one more card y'all I also want to say that some of you just may be, a, if you're not a Leo, you have a Leo placement in your chart or fire. Mm, that's funny. As I said that, fire. Yes. Some of you are a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or you have a fire sign placement in your chart. Some of you may be an earth sign or you have an earth sign placement in your chart. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Also, some of you may be in Aquarius as well. Okay. But that completes your reading, that completes your message. 
PAL3. If it resonated with you, give it a like, comment, or subscribe. I thank you so, so much. If it did not resonate with you, feel free to check out any of the other PALs. Also, feel free to go on my channel and check out my Pick a Card Messages playlist. Thank you so, so much. Until next time.